Okay, so this is the control box. So this would actually be like this. Oh, so I should do the hot glue. Oh, sorry. Okay, I forgot you were there. So should be closed. Now that looks funny, but it's not. So turn it on. So these are the devices and now they're all on. And here is the control panel that goes into the shower. There's two plugs coming out of it. And so it's like pump, UV heater, Valve 1, Valve 2, Valve 3, Valve 4, Valve 5, and then this one's not connected, but this would be like a momentary valve, P valve. And then, can I see inside? Not really. Anyway, so here we have it's just these three things. This goes inside there. Uh, AC DC adapter, the UV, UV on here, and off. That one takes a second to fade. They'll let in the UV, but it's okay. See, now it's off. And then the heater, so again, I'll go here. Heater. Oh, no, wait, that's the pump, sorry. So the pump turns on this. And that is the voltage regulator, or like that shows the voltage, actually. The voltage regulator is more inside there. Like so. It's like a, a buck converter, I think. And so... It's like full power, it goes up to 35 volts, so it's not very accurate on the lower voltages. Okay, and so this is the 12 volt, 12 volt power input, and one goes to the pump, and the other one goes here to power all the, the valves, these valves, and these ones are the two, 230 volt devices and so one is here the thermostat which I'll turn on heater heater and the thermostat goes on and the thermostat the heater is plugged into this this has both heating and cooling don't know what we could use the cooling for <sighs> cooling maybe to power a fan or something I don't know and then and then, that's about it. You got a power, so this basically kills everything. This is the on-off switch, and also an emergency stop. Here you have a ground fault circuit interrupter. So the power comes in from here, the, the main power that's like in, in the wall right now. And it comes in, and then it goes through this, the ground fault circuit interrupter, and we can test it here. It says test monthly, I think. So now that cut off all the power. So if there's like a difference in current in two places where there shouldn't be, then something else is absorbing the, the electricity, like your body, for instance. And then it'll like snap off really fast. And then... That goes through the on-off switch. And actually you can see here, if it's off, then this no longer works. Oh wait, no, it does work because it's it's powered through here, actually. Ah, that's good to know. And the, the pump also has like off here. So that turns it off and then it needs a couple volts. I think it's still feeding a few volts, but it's not enough to power the screen. So there should be like, maybe 
there. I don't know, should there be something else there? And then, uh, to demo the, the valves, if we go, you can see the lights go up. So, let's turn off valve one, valve two, Wait, focus. Silly strap, I gotta change it. Well, five off, four off, three off, two off, one off. And if it's more clear this way.